Okay, I had the worst mental shift. I was going, like I dropped my phone on the bus so I had to go get it. So I had to go, and what? What'd you say? Oh. I'm kind of filming right now. I'm doing a. I'm talking about a story. Then I will. Sorry, that was me thinking she said my name, but she really didn't. She said rascal. Since when am I a beagle? I have a Sona that's a beagle, but I'm not a beagle. <laughs> No beagle, uh, stereotypes. Uh, sorry about the fan and the TV, but I, anyways, I'm gonna get to the story. So I had to go back to the bus stop to, uh, get my phone. So I went back to the bus stop and got my phone. I have it, you obviously know, because I'm filming with it. But, um, when I was waiting... I shifted so bad, like I couldn't even get out of it. It was just like my seizures, but instead of a seizure, it was like a intense mental shift. But it wasn't into Khan, it was into uh, Blaze, the cat. So I really need some gear for him. Hopefully I can get some this year at the, at the con, at the convention. Uh, I'll just get the ears. I can't get the tail because uh, I don't. I have to get the paws still. So for uh, cream soda. <laughs> so yeah, I was just all of a sudden I just shifted right into a uh, blaze, and that doesn't happen very often. I meow a lot and hiss and purr and growl and stuff like that, but I never, like, feel act like an actual cat. So that was, like, really weird because I was, like, right connected to Khan, and then I just shifted into a t something I didn't expect I was going to shift into. So I shifted into right in public, and people were looking at me weird. Because I was like scratching the post that was behind me on the fence. And uh, face palming and uh, uh, pouncing and um, scratching the air and pawing the stop, this bus stop sign. So I was like, I couldn't control it. I just. I'm like, I know I'm embarrassing myself, but I can't stop doing this. It's just uncontrollable. It's like really weird. I don't know. I totally turned into a cat. It was so weird. <laughs> I'm going to get a bell call, a little bell call or two. And uh, cat ears and the cat, the cat tail. I'll have to see if I don't know. I, I don't know. I'll have to try to find one um, online or something. So yeah, <laughs> that was so awkward though. Oh my god! People were probably thinking she's whack, a doodle. Um. They call me she or he. They don't know my pronouns. Like, they probably either call me she because I'm wearing girls' pants. Or they probably would call me she, but I'm not she. I'm not he. I am they or them. But, uh, yeah. Um, I saw my friend Heath today and gave him, uh, 
my drawing I drew for him of his persona sprocket. That was nice, and uh, I almost fell flat on my face trying to get back up to my seat with Adam and Lacey on the bus. And he was with his son, and his son, his son, Heath was, Heath was with his son, and his son has Asperger's like me. And uh, what else happened? Oh yeah, I saw Alex Godin on the bus, and I'm like, oh, I gotta go to the back. I can't be anywhere near him. I'm deathly afraid of him, like... He did bad things to me and some of my friends and ex-friends and people I know. And he he's just, he's a really bad person. So, yeah. That's my stories. Bye.